So here we are back on swords only and I, I found this little artifact from the stream that I'd never looked into. That's uh highly unfortunate but that's okay we can dodge it we can get some good crits and whatnot but yeah i found this and i thought well this looks like it could actually be something pretty decent attack percent with crit rate crit damage and another attack and sometimes i wonder why i still play this game so ignore what i said about this being potentially a good piece that is now absolute garbage let's instead try to power up this one and hope it rolls into crit damage so here, uh, okay, nice. But you know, this could be an albedo piece. So let's try and get that to roll something good. Let's see what we get. What? Oh, flat defense. That's fun. That's, that's HP. That's not, that's not defense. But ignoring the fact that I just called that the wrong stat. Uh, let's see if that actually is an upgrade for our albedo. Oh, it's, uh, it, it, eh? it, it's pretty much the same. How do we have two of almost the same exact artifact? But since I just powered it up, I'm going to use it so I don't feel bad about the fact that I just powered it up. And currently we only have a four star defense percent in this slot. So let's just slap on a five star. We all know it's going to roll terribly. So it really doesn't even matter what the substats are. The elemental mastery is the most useless on a geo character. I'm sure this is all going to go right into it. Yeah, I, I wasn't that far off. You know what's really sad? My Kaya has 1,250 attack. We're not even gonna get into the crit rate or any of that stuff. Just looking at the attack, 1,250. My Beto on my new main already has 1,234 attack. And that account is like AR35. What did I do wrong on this account? It doesn't matter, this piece is gonna save it. It's gonna roll crit damage and we'll be on our way it's going to be amazing all right let's see that crit damage the juicy well i know you're kidding there is no way you mean to tell me that this artifact rolled flat defense and then rolled into flat defense and then rolled into a flat defense again wow i'm i, I have nothing that's that's actually impressive the fact that one person can get that unlucky it just I, i'm impressed and this is exactly why i need artifacts with four perfect stats this this is why I'm so greedy, because if it has one stat that is not ideal, it's all rolling into that. I am desperate for this to only go into the crits, please. I just I want some sort of upgrade out of all of this, or the flat HP. I've come back to this piece, because in comparison to what we've just seen, having it roll twice into flat defense, you know, that's, that's not the worst thing in the world, right? We've seen worse. So now we just need to see it roll into anything else. All right, here we go. This is how confident I am in this piece. 10 levels all the way up. Watch this. Okay, uh, I mean, that's kind of painful to see, but you know what? It isn't flat defense. And to top it all off, a little more crit damage. Okay, this piece still sucks, but I'm going to use it. And now Kaya has a little bit more attack. We're still not going to talk about that crit ratio though. Now I want to go ahead and test out my damage here. And unfortunately, the first place I went is the Ella Musk commission where, you know, you're not supposed to actually fight anything. So let's go ahead and just screw this up entirely. Oh, I want wonder what line we should say. Let, this one's gotta be it, right? Oh, that, that was wrong? Oh, darn it. Now I'm gonna have to fight things. Oh, I sure hate having to fight things, especially when it's raining and I have Kaya. Um, uh, okay, let's, let's freeze. Charge attack, charge attack. 2,500 seems like the highest that we can hit right now. That's mildly D disappointing and by mildly disappointing i mean extremely disappointing mind you we are using a physical damage sword on top of a physical damage artifact so uh i i know we don't have the right sets and everything but i was hoping it would be more than 2500 oh 
look there, we hit a 3200. Crazy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Pause. These are back. These give me. These give me. Not using those yet, but I'm definitely using these right now. Just give me the kaching. It's been so long. Just give. Just give me the kaching. I, I don't think I'm asking for that much. It's just a little five star. And our next five star on standard is guaranteed to be a character because we got two weapons that weren't swords on the last two times that we had a five star. So, uh, sword character, please. Please? Or, you know, a great sword. It's it's a sword. It's great, but it's not something we can use. Well, now, now that we get the bad stuff out of the way, this is the one where we're actually going to get the five star. Okay, nope, nope. I don't want the five star anyways. Ka-ching, not even something that I wanted. We're only at like 18 pity on this banner. Oh, this is so sad. So now that that disappointment is out of the way, um, there is an event right now where it's like the custom domain thing going on. And, you know, I, I thought I was going to get some content out of that. I was planning on making a whole video for it. And then I tried to go do exactly that and realized the event's pretty boring so I don't think I'm actually going to be going ahead and putting out that video so instead I'll just show you some clips to show why that event is as bad as I say it is or at least why I don't like it as much as I don't let's see what this is all about though oh we just we just go straight into this wait I'm, I'm a little I'm a little confused so this is me designing I thought I had to beat it or am I wait am I placing things in to let me beat it well then isn't that all that i need there's a whole one coin that i have to collect here this is not at all what i was expecting and i got the coin that was boring wait so what's happening now am i doing the same what what am i doing um what 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 am i i, I don't get it what is my goal is it uh, just keep going okay sure so here's the thing, you can use skills. That's, uh, that's, that's good to know. That seems like a major oversight. So pretend that my excitement was just hypothetically a 10 out of 10 before I did that. It is now a two. Can I be honest? I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of the whole, uh, collect the coins aspect of this. I thought it was just get through the domain. You can make like parkour and puzzles. And I, th I thought that was the draw. Wait, you don't even need to get all the coins in order to get all the rewards and <laughs> all you have to do for online is play in one person's domain once you don't have to beat it publish one domain and design one domain and pretty much you're done with this entire event hoyoverse really said you know we don't have ideas for events let's just make the community make the event for us what, what is the point of this it's a room with a bunch of these little electro things, but it's pointless. Why even put that in the game? Now, before I go online and do some other people's, let's first just go ahead, design a domain, just so we can see what we're gonna be working with. Wait, 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 wait. Why is all of this already in here? Reset the room. I don't I don't want any of this. Clear the area. Everything cleared perfectly, but that's not cleared. How is this cleared? Excuse me? So remember when I said my excitement was down to a two? Yeah, let's lower that to a one. A nice Nice solid one and you can't even move the starting point that it's just it's just stuck here that's great no that's I perfect so uh I hate to say it but that one out of ten it's like a point five now you know no I think it's actually going into the negatives so yeah uh not a big fan of that event and that's unfortunate because I was actually looking forward to just you know breaking domains as I usually do so I'll do the event to get the primos but I don't think I need to bore you guys with doing it in a video I can just do it on the side just pretend there's a really good segue right here because this video is sponsored by Skillshare I'm gonna be honest with all of you many years of attending school made me almost come to hate learning new things there are so many skills and talents I'd love to pick up but they always seem like a massive of undertaking and I thought I had learning new things of phobia. Then came this little thing called Skillshare. All the courses are structured to teach you what you want to learn no matter how much experience you do or don't have. Best of all, they make it easy. Search what you want to learn, pick a class, and start learning that new skill. I decided to take a class called Pixel Art Master Course by Mislav. The class is designed to teach you how to create pixel art and even pixel art animations from zero prior experience. I've dabbled with pixel art 
art before, but since I want to make more custom emotes for our Twitch chat, this seemed like the perfect place to learn everything at once. I'm not even saying this just for the sponsorship, I'm genuinely excited to continue with this class and use what I've learned. Since Skillshare is sponsoring this video, they're offering the first 1,000 people who use the link in the description one month of free access to absolutely all of Skillshare's classes, so go start pursuing your passions today. Thanks again to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. I realized, or rather remembered, that the uh, the Raiden Shogun sequel is available, I think. Well, I mean, I know it's available, but I don't know if it's available for me yet. But you see, I kind of never did Shen He's story quest on this account. Haha, <laughs> funny story about that. Uh, you see, I, I, I couldn't do it. I, I wanted to so badly, but I, I couldn't because, uh, well, I was doing software updates yeah i was i was doing software updates because you know i'm an ai for like you know a week two weeks maybe longer i definitely just wasn't too lazy to do it on another account i promise so i may or may not have to go do uh, all of chen has story quest right now in hopes that that unlocks the raiden shogun sequel well Welcome to the Shen He Story Quest speedrun any person. Considering that we're using Kaya, who is a cryo character, wouldn't it be really cool if we had another cryo character on the team who maybe, I don't, I don't know, like boosted cryo damage and helped out with that kind of stuff? Obviously, we don't have anyone like that because the only cryo sword character on the team is Kaya. Oh, and the next wave is here. How exciting. It's truly a very hard opponent who just falls down and gets frozen. Oh wow, look, it's it's gone. And now we go back to just hitting this thing. Oh, more enemies. I had no idea. I am truly surprised. I did not expect there to be more enemies in here. I definitely did not already do this on a another account. This truly is an extraordinary fight. I sure do love breaking the ancient array. It is so fun. Oh look, a silly. I wonder where it goes. Paimon, please shut up. I don't want to do this domain again. This is just an excuse for me to try and make my voice as robotic as possible. Now we get to go fight Osiles. What? <coughs> <laughs> We get to go fight Osile's wife. What am I doing with my life? Oh, <laughs> oh I forgot about all this. You have the, the stupid hotel that they never let you see the inside of. Then we have to go use our visions to find whatever ore they want us to find. And by visions, they literally just mean your eyes because you just open them and see it. You guys want to see something crazy real quick? You see how we're gliding? Watch this. Watch it. Watch. Okay, we're gliding. All right, let's just say we uh, waited for, I don't know, like almost 12 hours. And then uh, after those 12 hours, we're still gliding somehow. Unless I am mistaken, I believe we got everything done in this quest and all we have to do now is actually fight the boss. This looks good, right? We, we're not doing anything else. We don't have any more quests. We just talk and fight right? Just, just fight. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Was fighting, no. Was fighting that boss only part of the Lantern Left event? No, I, I doubt that. I just don't remember this part whatsoever. Oh, no, I guess, huh. So we are still gonna fight it. I must have just completely spammed through this during the live stream. I don't know how I managed to do that. now. 
now it's boss time. Now I know I, I could edit this all to be like some fancy fight and everything, but uh, I it's just, it, it, it's not. We're just gonna smack these heads around and uh, yeah, that that's about it. I'll save the fancier editing for Raiden Shogun 2.0. Assuming that she has some flashy animations, cause I'm gonna be honest, other than the trailer, I have not seen anything about that boss fight. I've been keeping myself spoiler free. I will say this fight seems like it'd be a lot Lot more fun if you had bows because half the time uh, the boss kind of just sits off the stage and you just wait. Alright, that's two heads down. Now we just got one head left and uh, you just, yeah, you, you avoid the one attack and you wait. I don't know why they have to add a little animation there as if they're about to do some massive attack when literally it's a few raindrops that just fall onto the platform and like you can get hit and you're completely fine. So yeah, it's a pretty straightforward fight. If nothing else, it's really just a waiting game. That's not the right head. That's the right head. All right, so we should be good here, I think. Yeah, all right, that's easy enough. I think that's it. In terms of this quest, at least, I, I, th I think that's the whole J chamber reconstruction thing. So now, uh, uh oh, how do we actually get the next quest for Raiden Shogun. Do I have to like do the Sarai and Tsurumi and all that stuff? Cause yeah, I, I never did any of that on this account and I'd really rather keep it that way. I looked it up quickly and it seems that we have to do this quest first and then it unlocks the second part, which is the Raiden Shogun, you know, sequel thingy with the new boss fight, or at least that's what I'm hoping. But that means I'm going to have to take A on a tour of the city to drink milk and take pictures. Now, don't get me wrong. A is my favorite character in this game, but that's just spamming through dialogue. I can't really say it's something that I'm uh, looking forward to. 